The exhibition is about China in the 1980s and I found that I was in a country that was both very youthful and undergoing great changes. I decided to stay and to record them. The principal motivation was to record daily life which uh, I think was more interesting than the, the sort of special events or, or, or big news. There were a lot of people outside China that were keen to learn more about so what this recently reopened country was like. What surprised me most I suppose was that I went to China interested in China as a sort of abstract concept, another world, uh, mainly interested in the past and the traditions. Um, and when I came I found that um, the present day reality was uh, very exciting and, 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 and full of um, dynamism and change and it was a very youthful country, especially when I first went there. So spending my youth in a country which was dominated by more than half the population was under 25 when I was first there. So. I think they give a very different flavour and energy to the place than I'd expected. The one with the five uh, young men standing on the Bund in their sort of uh, flares and uh, bouffant hairdos. It was a passing encounter and they just came towards me as I turned around the corner and we had a very short interaction. I took a couple of pictures and, and carried on. And it was only later that I realised, well, disco dancing wasn't even allowed in China. so to actually be dressed up uh, at that time it was very brave. But it speaks to a sort of uh, an innocence and optimism and a, a turning towards having fun that, that was new for China, which has previously been quite chaotic uh, and, and was entering a new phase of, of its history. Well, I'm glad to be able to share these pictures because when I looked at them again, I was reminded of the, uh, the positive side of a country that had had a very rough and, and violent history in years, you know, not, not very far before this time, and uh, that it was turning over a new leaf. The young people were more or less in charge, they were driving things forward. It was a very happy and positive time, and in many ways simpler and more understandable than the modern world. Well, I, I hope people will feel some of the sort of joy and optimism of that time. The fact that uh, people were able to express themselves a little bit better, they could dress the way they wanted and, 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 and have a bit of fun.